Hello everybody and welcome back to Crusader Kings where things are a little bit awkward for us right now but I want to do something dumb just for a meme. So let's go ahead and switch character real quick. We're going to head over to Klingenberg here and uh, all I want to do here, literally the whole thing, is I want to go here and I want to change one vowel from Klingenberg to Klingonberg. Perfect. That's all I want to do. Done. Okay, we're going to switch back. <laughs> okay, so we're going to switch back here. There we go. We have won this war, but I want... Well, actually, we don't need... Well, we need to occupy here. We don't need to occupy here, technically. But let's group up all of our troops over here. And we became the dynasty head, yes. We are over our domain limit in an awkward fashion. And we'll deal with that in a moment. But we're just going to head over here. I don't necessarily care about taking the chunks of Italy that are out over here, right? So all we want is to occupy this. Okay. 15 days left. Done. And with that, we enforce these demands. Beautiful. Okay, now we are against the Holy War for Duchy of Lombardy up over this way. Okay, Augsburg. Sure. We'll head up over here, and uh, this is not the path I expected us to take. But I guess it works. We'll have these guys come in here and slow siege. Now, we're going to need counselors, for sure. We're going to put in our chancellor, and our steward, and our marshal, and our spymaster. There we go. Okay. So far, so good. Now, we're 21 out of 6 here. We're definitely going to have to hand out some titles. So, we will go ahead and do so. We'll hand out all of these. And I believe we have the Italy Kingdom title right now. We do not hold the Kingdom of Italy title. But we can, we can make that for sure. And we'll go ahead and do so. So, we'll create that title. The, uh, hmm, where is it? Do we hold it? Did I just miss it? Does your part of Despotate of Italy. Oh, okay, she still holds it, but she is, we would have to usurp it. Got it. Now, this territory was ours previously, and we're just reconquering it. So I think that's acceptable for having it not be entirely coastal. I think we can get away with that one. So we're going to grant this on over and this on over. We don't need to hold a single one of these. Beautiful. So we'll grant all of that. We're down to 12. And down to 10. There's a couple over here. Cool. That puts us back at 8 of 6. And now the question is, can we hand out anything over this way? One, two, three, four, five, six. And then seven. We should be able to have one that we can hand out, I believe. What title do we hold that we shouldn't? Here, Rome. Got it. We'll hand that out as well. So we're only one above our limit here. It's not ideal, but it'll have to do for the moment. And I want to make sure, because we were murdered in our last life, I want to make sure that we are disrupting schemes. There we go. We gained a level of fame. That's always good. And we don't have a spouse for the moment. We can certainly grant vassals over to rightful lieges, and we will do so. There we go. And I'd love to usurp the despotate of Italy, but we can't do that right now. We can negotiate an alliance with our sister, and we will do so. Cool. And we could lawfully imprison this guy, but there's no real point in doing so at this exact moment. Okay. So over we head. We are slightly over our domain limit, but that should eventually change. We're not betrothed. We know that. And we're not surprised that there's going to be some factionalism here. Let's see. 
Beautiful. So we'll get that done. <laughs> oh, I messed that up. I definitely messed that up. Whoops. Okay, we have to break this. They're going to be unhappy. But we should be able to negotiate an alliance here, correct? We can break this betrothal as well and make her even more unhappy. And then arrange a marriage here and recreate this to get that alliance back. Done. Okay. And the reason I had to break that initial betrothal was because I accidentally had it be non-matrilineal. That would have been a big problem. That was entirely my own fault. And we're just going to head up over here and begin a siege. For now, things are looking reasonable. How many troops do they have in total? 4K? We see most of them down over here. Fantastic. We're going to split off some forces here. We're going to split off our mangonels and a bit of a siege force. Something like this. They're going to head into Innsbruck. And we are going to continue to siege with a siege commander. And then these guys, they're going to come back down this way and try to deal with this force, ideally. They're currently embarking. We'll see what we end up having happen there. A scandalous priest. Okay. And this is an independence faction. Not too shocking. Hmm. We can do something like this. We don't have to go through with this betrothal. But we can do something like that. Beautiful. Okay. So they're coming in over this way. Sounds good to me. What else do we have going on here? Okay, what can we do with this guy? Hmm. Can we negotiate with any of these straight up? No. Well, maybe, but no. Okay, so what do we have available? Very little, because we died so young previously. Okay. Okay. So we may end up having to fight for the Kingdom of Venice. This would be awkward timing. What else do we have going on here? Not a lot else. Okay. I'm just thinking about how I want to proceed on this. This is commanded by Ruler over here. So we absolutely want to track this army down. Apparently they're going to fight us here. Trying to buy themselves time, I guess. They're going to lose that badly. We have realized that we are heterosexual. That's reasonably convenient for our fertility. And now we're going to fight this force. Okay, now we're going to come in and maybe fight this force. Nope, we don't catch them just yet. Now we catch them. Beautiful. We're hoping that this ends this war. It did not. We did not capture their leader, which made me very sad. But it is what it is. How are things going here? Three months and eight months. Okay. This is going to be very awkward, for sure. We're at very negative prestige. Can we negotiate with anyone in any of these factions? I believe the answer to that is probably no. Our options are incredibly limited right now. Our options are incredibly, incredibly limited. Are you willing to white piece? Not yet. That's very unfortunate, too. If we could get out of this war, things would be potentially a lot better. We're going to fight this force here. Okay. We're 42% right now. 
They would accept a white piece. Done. I don't want anything to do with this war at this moment. Okay. At this point, we're going to disband all of our troops here. We're being raided, so we can't necessarily disband these with, a, with one click, but that's okay. Okay, so next up, these guys are going to send their demands. Basically guaranteed. We can bounce this faction. By doing this. This is not necessarily great. But we'll do that. Okay. So we bounce that faction. Cool. We could become just, and I think that's pretty decent here. Yes. We're going to become just. That puts us up to 7 of 7 on our domain limit. Cool. Then we can definitely get some prestige back. And these guys are going to... Actually, they're too weak right now. They may send their ultimatum. Or they may not. They're losing their discontent. We just need a month tick here. Okay, there we go. Beautiful. So we currently don't have any major faction problems. Okay. This guy's only skill 13. I'm going to put this guy on our council. Now, he is a powerful vassal. And for the moment, that's okay. She is a powerful vassal. We decline that. We do not want her to exit the prison. This is acceptable. Okay, let's go look at Italy here. They're no longer at war. So at this point, we want to usurp the despotate of Italy. There we go. Consider that done. We can also usurp the Duchy of Lombardy. And that's great. We will definitely do so. Now we have too many held duchies, and we're going to need to grant this out. So we'll grant this to our uncle here. The Jarldom of Lombardy. Beautiful. We could also give out the kingdom title, but for now, I don't think there's a huge amount of point to doing that. We will ransom off any of these prisoners who are not vassals. We need to keep our vassals in prison at this point, if we can, for as long as possible. Okay. How old are we? We are 12. Okay. Beautiful. Okay, there is a dangerous faction. We're not surprised about that. This faction has returned. Let's see how strong they really are, though. Seven months. Interesting. Very, very interesting indeed. So the King of Scotland here. Hmm. I'm wondering if we can spread some cash around. Also, I don't know why... Oh, you're, that's just marked as a vassal? Okay. I see. Well, let's see about uh, sending this guy a little bit of cash. For 19 opinion. He might accept a demand to convert. He did not. Okay. Good to know. Who else is in this? This guy. I'm going to send him a gift and demand his conversion as well. Us are a little low, but look at that. They're down to 60% now. There's no powerful va vassal factions at this moment. We will go ahead and get some prestige here. Okay. 
So this faction is just barely up there. Okay. Just looking through these for the moment. I think we want to fight this faction. Ultimately. We'll see if they get a huge amount of additional support, and if they do, we may do something about it. But I think for the moment, we want to allow this faction to fire and just deal with them. So we would raise up, like, right here. For the moment, I'm definitely going to work on upgrading our castles down here where we can. Any of these that have military structures, we're definitely going to put money into upgrading. So here, and here, and in our capital as well. Done. Okay. So that will boost up our perceived power level a little bit. They're 80%. And the rest of these aren't too powerful for the moment. So I think this is fine. They're going to send their ultimatum in one month. And we're going to fight them. We are absolutely going to fight them. We don't ransom our vassal here. Cool. They can send their ultimatum at any time. We're going to begin pre-raising our troops. Any moment now, they'll send their ultimatum. There it is. I will not be threatened. Cool. So we've got a few days left on raising our troops here. Beautiful. Okay. So here's what we're going to do. We're going to split off a siege force here of about 9, 10,000, somewhere in here. Yeah. Should be reasonably okay for the moment. We're going to bring this in over here. We may need to move more troops into our primary fighting force, but I just want to keep this reasonably safe. Then we're going to come down over this way, and we're going to look to cut off these guys before they can group up. Beautiful. Got him. Okay, there's going to be another faction potentially. Who is this? Catholic populists? Okay. We can try to demand conversion for both of these. I doubt it'll work, but we'll see. Okay. Actually, I accept the hook there. Done. Beautiful. Now we're going to head up over this way. And are they doing much up over here? Not at the moment. Okay. We do see a pretty large army moving south from Scotland. We're going to come down over here and what's this now? The Disillusion Faction? Very rude. Very rude indeed. Hmm. Okay. They're not super powerful. We're going to walk up over here and look to fight these guys. Now, they have reinforcements on the way, but we stack wiped that. Now, we're going to come in over here. So, we're at 9% for the moment. And where's this force? They're up over here sieging. Looks good to me. We're going to fight these guys. I don't expect this to stack wipe, although we did crush that very quickly. No, that didn't stack wipe. Okay. So. Got it. We're going to head up over this way and try to deal with this force. We're currently ill. We'll send for a physician. Okay. We'll do a safe treatment and it should be fine. Okay, so 
So these guys are running around over this way. For the moment, that's completely okay. We'll become calm. And I want to come up over this way, ideally. I'm not sure if they have the numbers. Well, if all of these grouped together, they'd have the numbers. But they are attempting to prevent this fight up here. They're trying to get up here to reinforce this. And they fail. So this is great. We're going to win this fight easily. And this siege is underway nicely. So that's beautiful. Now we're going to come down this direction and continue to fight them. We've won a lot of battles. And we need to continue to do so. We're trying to just catch some of them out here. And we did. Beautiful. This siege finished, and we'll head down over this way. We're now at 40% war score. And what is this? This Dissolution Faction will send their ultimatum at any time. There's nothing we can do right now for that. Okay. We're going to head over here and eliminate this force. That should stack wipe. Beautiful. So here we go. We're not going to destroy our titles. We will not be threatened. Okay, so what is the actual war goal of this? I'm not sure what a Dissolution Faction's war goal is. Okay. So this is a problem, right? It's a pretty major one. There's no doubt about that. We're going to head down over this way for the moment. We need to eliminate this faction quickly. They may, at this point, be willing to accept a white piece. We're no longer ill. That is good. So, we catch this force and stack wipe it. Oh! We captured his son in air. We just won that. Beautiful. We enforce those demands. These guys are going to group up down here. Next. We need to figure out how we're going to fight this disillusion faction. Now, their faction is a little bit on the weak side, if I'm honest. Their troops are primarily down here. Okay. So our plan then has to be that we're going to come down this way and sail around. And we have to move quickly. Now, we're going to take a pretty hefty amount of attrition doing this. But we're just going to make our way down here. We'll be there in three months. Um, we'll try to go diligent. Hey, we got diligent. Beautiful. And I'm going to raise up any additional troops here that we can. And we'll just be ready to meet our existing troops, which will arrive here in a couple of months. Now we're very glad that we have Armillary Sphere. And we're going to head in here soon. Arriving here in 10 days. We group this all together. Then we're going to walk up over this way. And we're going to try to give some battle. Now, this guy is the war leader. So that's great. They don't want to fight us. They finished their siege up. So we're going to stop here very briefly. They're fighting over here. I love it. So we are going to leave behind a siege force here of about 5k strength, I think. We'll give them a Siege Commander. And we are going to... Do we have a Siege Commander right now? Are they all rebelling? They are all rebelling. Okay, so we'll give them this Commander, I guess. He's not a Siege Commander, but he'll have to do. We're going to come in over this way. And they don't want to fight this. We're going to come up over here. I think we catch part of their force. No, we do not. We're going to pursue them a bit. Okay. We're going to stop here for the moment. And we're going to let these guys move along a little bit. There we go. We caught a good chunk of their troops here, and the rest aren't interested in fighting us. Beautiful. Now we're going to come back over here. I would love to chase down these lads. We'll see how viable that is. 
Oh, the lucky Egyptian coin was destroyed. That's unfortunate. But we're going to come over this way, and we're going to catch something here. Yes. We caught a good section of their troops there. Beautiful. They have more coming in, but that's irrelevant to us. Okay, we're going to continue fighting up over this way. Because disillusion is unacceptable to us. Beautiful. So they're retreating all up over this way. We're going to come over here. And we're going to siege down this way. We're going to position here. I would like to catch this force, but I don't think that's going to happen. Actually, it is. Cool. So we catch this force. That should stack wipe. Then we're going to come up here and fight these guys. Now, they're going to finish that siege, I think. But that's okay. Yeah, we're going to continue to fight them up here. We outnumber them extremely heavily, and that should be fine. There's another faction brewing here. It is Catholic Populists. I'm not too concerned about that one. That shouldn't be a big deal. Okay, we just hit 46% from that siege. Beautiful. And we win this battle. That put us at 57%. From here, we are going to split our force in half. Half of them will go here, and half of them will go here and slow siege this back. But it is time to put a cut in here, so I'm going to go ahead and do that. And next episode, we will finish up dealing with this disillusion faction. You can leave your offerings to the engagement gods in the form of likes, comments, subscribes, and bell ringings, and a very special thank you to all of the channel members for making this video possible, including Casserol, Sigma162, JJ Gamer, Spartan News, Nick Smarty, Video Games Are Not Real, Dimitri H, Punching the Microphone, Kadra, Raw Potato, El Michi Nazi, Justin Everett, Emiliano Cambron, Martin Lawrence, and all the rest. And of course, you. Thank you for watching. If you'd like to support the channel, you can click the join button down below the video. And as always, I will see you all next time.